Question 1. What is Active Directory Domain Services 2008? Answer. Active Directory Domain Services ADBs formerly known as Active Directory Services is the central location for configuration information, authentication requests and information about all of the objects that are stored within your forest. Using Active Directory you can efficiently manage users, computers, groups, printers, applications and other directory enabled objects from one secure centralized location. Question 2. What is domain functional level? Answer. Domain functionality activates features that affect the whole domain and that domain only. The four domain functional levels, their corresponding features and supported domain controllers are as follows. Windows 2000 Mixed Default Supported Domain Controllers Microsoft Windows NT 4.0 Windows 2000 Windows Server 2003 Activated Features Local and Global Groups Global Catalog Support Question 3. What is RID Master? Answer. The RID Master is responsible for processing RID pool requests from all domain controllers see a particular domain. When a DC creates a security principal object such as a user or group, it attaches a unique security ID, SID, to the object. This SID consists of a domain SID the same for all SIDs created in a domain, and a relative ID, RID, that is unique for each security principal SID created in a domain. Each DC in a domain is allocated a pool of RID to start it is allowed to assign to the security principles it creates. When a DC's allocated RID pool falls below a threshold, that DC issues a request for additional RIDs to the domain's RID master. The domain RID master responds to the request by retrieving RIDs from the domain's unallocated RID pool and assigns them to the pool of the requesting DC. At any one time, there can be only one domain controller acting as the RID master in the domain.pdc emulator. Question 4. What is DHCP? Answer. It gives addresses automatically to the client who is requesting for an IP address centralized IP address management. DHCP prevent IP address conflict and help conserve the use of client IP address only on the network. DHCP reduces the complexity and amount of administrator work by assigning TIP IP configuration automatically to the clients. Question 5. What is the global catalog? Answer. A global catalog server is a domain controller. It is a master searchable database that contains information about every object in every domain in a forest. The global catalog contains a complete replica of all objects in Active Directory for its host domain and contains a partial replica of all objects in Active Directory for every other domain in the forest. It has two important functions provides group membership information during logo and authentication helps users locate resources in Active Directory. Question 6. What is RODX? Answer. Read-only domain controllers. RODX address some of the problems that are commonly found in branch offices. These locations might not have a DC, or they might have a writable DC but no physical security to that DC, low network bandwidth or inadequate expertise to support that DC. Question 7. What are the functionalities of RODX? Answer. Functionality of RODX. Read-only D's database. Unidirectional replication. Credential caching. Administration. Traitor role separation. Question 8. What are FMSO roles? List them. Answer. FSMO roles are server roles in a forest. There are five types of FSMO roles. Schema master, domain naming master, RID master, PDC emulator, infrastructure master. Question 9. What is Schema Master? Answer. The Schema Master domain controller controls all updates and modifications to the schema. Once the schema update is complete, it is replicated from the Schema Master to all other DCs in the directory. To update the schema of a forest, you must have access to the Schema Master. There can be only one Schema Master in the whole forest. Question 10. What is Domain Naming Master? Answer. The Domain Naming Master Domain Controller controls the addition or removal of domains in the forest. This DC is the only one that can add or remove a domain from the directory. It can also add or remove cross-references to domains in external directories. There can be only one Domain Naming Master in the whole forest.